What's good? It's your girl, Ruchi Raw, and you are now tuned in with 20 Questions with Weezy. Let's get it. What's going on? What's, what's, what's good? What's good? I appreciate you having me on here today. Yeah, for sure you are. You know what man. So what's good? Y'all, it's your boy, T. Weezy, man. You know how I am. You know how I rock. I'm chilling. Look, we on 20 Questions with Weezy, man. We got very special guests. I'm going to introduce herself. What's going on? What's good? It's your girl, Ruchi Raw, coming straight from the 260. Shit, okay. Ruchi Raw, real and wealthy. That's what we all stand for. So okay, okay. I had to clarify that for some people that you know might not know. Okay, okay. Yeah, I was. I sure was gonna ask you that because I ain't mean, know what's your name. I'm like, how you say it? <laughs> yeah, yeah, some man yeah, yeah. people be saying some off the wall shit. Yeah. Some off the wall shit. Yeah. Ruchi, Ruchi tires. You gotta keep it rolling. Okay. You know, okay. so simple. Ruchi Raw. Okay, okay. That's what's up? So. So I have never heard of you. You are, you are an upcoming artist. I work with a lot of upcoming artists. Um, and normally what I do, I check out their pages, see what they doing, you know what I mean, see if they're making any moves, see if they got any progress. Um, how did you how did you get into rapping? Well, I initially music has always been my life from the jump. So when I was twelve I remember my cousin, he had gave me this MP3 player and it had all these songs on it. And what I distinctly remember is listening to Nicki Minaj, Itty Bitty Piggy. And okay. just when I heard that, it's just like, damn, I'm fucking with this shit, you know? Right, right, right. So then just like years later, I'm like, I tell my mom, I'm like, mom, I'm a, I'm a rap. I'm like to damn her 12 years old and shit. I'm like, mom, I'm a rap. She's like, oh, yeah, whatever. You know, most parents okay. not going to take that shit serious because right, they don't right. see that longevity. Right, right, right. You know, if they, people don't see that dream, they're not going to believe it until... You yeah. actually bring that shit out. Right, right, right. So, okay. I mean, I hit up the studio and I was just like, damn, this shit, I made my first song, Ambitions. Okay. Uh, with yeah. In-House. Okay. Shout out and to In-House. Shout out to In-House. So, you know, I was feeling it. I'm yeah. like, okay, I can do something with this shit. So, okay. Cool, cool. That's what's up. So, you hearing, you hearing the 260. I know a lot of artists. Um... I have never seen you before. Like, where you come from? <laughs> like, what side of I town? mean, shit. I mean, I'm not repping no side of town. I come from, shit. I grew up on Cano. I mean, on the south side. I went to Snyder. I was moving around a lot. I went to Snyder. I went to south side. Shit. Fucking Lane, you know. Okay. okay. I mean, I grew up being that person. Like, people wouldn't expect me to be like... When people first found out that I was rapping, it was like heaven, heaven, heaven Parker, you know. Right, right. So just oh, growing so up, it's like it. yeah. So okay. it's just like, so it's just like growing up, people just would never expect that. So okay, how old are you? I'm 22, fresh 22. 22. Dang, young. Okay. Yeah. Dang, you feel old, dang. <laughs> old, old, old. Yeah, fresh. class of 2018, Snyder High School. Okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. Sure. Um, so. I heard your track, you know what I mean? Thumb work. Okay. Thumb work. I like it. All right. I liked it. I really did like that. Well, okay. She's saying some things. She ain't, she ain't rapping like she's from somewhere else, you know what I mean? Right. Like, you, you, you generally rap just how you rap, you know what right. I mean? You, you can hear your word, you enunciate, you know what I mean? You do all that. And I, I, I applaud you for that because a lot of rap today, you don't know what they're saying. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Which. It's cool. I still rock with that, you know what I mean? But I'm like, okay, she breaking down every word, every syllable, you know what I mean? You got a little flow to you. I'm feeling it. I right, appreciate right. that. And the fact that you young and you ain't trying to be on nobody else's way, you trying to create your own way, I respect you more for that. Yeah, for sure. You know what I mean? I respect sure. you more for that than just trying to go, oh, yeah, I'm about to crap like I'm from Detroit. <laughs> or, or acting, or, you know, yeah, no, you know for saying? real. Like, Shout out to all these places. Too, yeah, man, they, sure, but they definitely doing their thing. But I mean, when you coming up with your own sound, you trying to, you trying to get noticed, right? You know what I mean. Um, so have you worked with anybody? You know, <sighs> got any features or anything? I got some shit in the works right now. By the time this video drop, it might be out. It might not. But I mean, right now I can't really speak on it. But I mean, I got some shit in the works for sure. Right. 
Yeah, it's some real shit. I'm excited. I have I don't have no features out there. I'm really trying to get some features, you know, I'm trying to get some people on, um, you know, okay. trying to do some shit, but yeah. just being a female, you know, female rapper, you try to get those, you know, you get people yeah, that try sure. to, oh, let me do a feature and then we get to talk about the music. We're going to do what we talking about in the music. I'm like, oh. this, you know, so, so it's kind of hard. You got to keep, you, you got to keep it business yeah, with a lot sure, of, sure. with a lot of, you know, uh, male rappers. Uh, male rappers, yeah. Because I know, like, um, I ain't, ain't going to lie. So my guy just had an interview with him in C4 Dub. Okay. Um, he said he rocking with your music. And he a, he a hot new artist as well. Oh, shit. You know I mean, he making moves, though. Man, a lot of moves. And he, he dope. He definitely gonna rock with you, so just be on the lookout for that. Okay. You know what I mean? Probably by, the time, probably by the time this interview is over, I mean, his will be out. And then you'll see it. You know, okay. okay. Yeah, yeah, but he definitely came to me. I was like, hell, it's this rapper from Fort Wayne. You know what I mean? She, she hard. I gotta work with her. I'm like, oh, yeah, I got you. So that's why I come and play. I'm like, oh, right, I yeah. Got you. yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Um, yeah, so I mean, no, no music videos. I got one music video, and that's Thumb Work. Okay, okay. So, yeah, and I just cool. recently shot that in December. So, okay, cool, cool. Um, how are you going about like marketing wise? Like, has anybody talked to you or broke down the business side of the music? Because it's not just about rapping, right? You know what I mean? Like, it's crucial to know that business. So. Are you branding? I'm, I'm, I'm in the process of trying to get my own clothing line out there, getting my name trademarked, mm -hmm. you know, everything, all that. Like, I'm just now starting to be able to take music a little bit more serious and not let people try to swindle me out of my voice. You know right, what I'm saying? Right. Right. When you know who you are, you can't let just anybody try to... You know, put like you control. Yeah, you know, I'm always trying to be true to who I am. So, right. I know who I am. I know what my worth is. Okay. Excuse me, yeah. but I know. You know, I know what I can do with my voice. Mm -hmm. So, if you know how to use your voice, you can go. Yeah, man. A lot of places, a lot of places. Okay. So, so you're from Fort Wayne, but you, but I know for the interview we had talk. <laughs> You yeah. Done, you done, you done dipped out. You moved. Yeah, I moved to Albuquerque. <laughs> Albuquerque, New Mexico. Okay. New Mexico is still in the United States. I don't need a passport. Um, <laughs> right. You don't know how many people ask me, like, right. damn, wait, you moved out of the country? No. Right. Like, oh, my okay. God. So, how is it? How's it living over there versus over here? Like, uh... It's most definitely different. I yeah. mean, yes, yeah, it's, it's yeah. very different. Shit, there's mountains everywhere. I'm literally in the desert. 10,000. <laughs> I'm on top of a mountain 10,000 feet in the air. That's oh, like, nice. yeah, the elevation is high as fuck out there. That and we just legalized out there. Oh, okay. So that's part of the reason why you moved. Yeah. I mean, yeah, Fort Wayne, they ain't got that. <laughs> they ain't got that yet. Uh, it's coming, though. It's coming, hopefully. Uh, so cool, cool. So, I mean... As far as like being a new artist, how do you like it? I mean, has anything like come up? To yeah, I'm or? very excited actually. Tomorrow, I'm actually tonight. I'm leaving out and I'm going to Dallas to do a show in front of the core DJs. Okay. And I'm really excited about that. Okay, that's shout gonna out be to the core DJs. You know that's gonna core be DJs. Really. That's gonna be dope. Yeah, that's yeah. gonna be really dope. That's gonna be dope. Yeah, yeah. I got some people out in Dallas. So I'll probably tell them to slide through. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's gonna be like at least five hundred DJs out there. Okay, that's what's yeah. up. Yeah, that's a lot of DJs. Yeah, make sure, man. That's 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 where the business is. Right, I mean. you gotta have the DJs on your side. Like they're the ones that's pushing the music out there for exactly. us. They yeah. playing, <laughs> they spinning that shit on the radio. Exactly, so. exactly. You know what I mean? Okay, so you uh, you definitely smart by getting DJs on your side because a lot of people they like, uh, I don't need DJs. I just want to go out here and just try to make it. You know what I mean? Every, right. Every aspect of the game is crucial. You know what I mean? From the DJs to the producers to the engineers to whoever you're networking with, everybody is a crucial, vital part of uh, playing a role of getting your music out there. 
for your sure. success. Um, so, like your relationships, like how do you how do you handle relationships? Like not as in like going out, but like yo. Your business relationship. I try to keep um, the relationships in business, business. You know, like I, me personally, I I run late, so I I have to try to keep that together. Yeah. But like I, when it comes to business, it's like it is what it is. Money, you got the money there. We exchange a service. You know, we handle it. You know. Anything outside of that doesn't matter if we're not talking about business. I don't, okay, you know, cool. You got to keep business and personal totally separate at all times. Yep, at all times. Okay, cool, cool. <sighs> so, yeah, so, so you're saying keep the personal away from the business, That's right? Good. Sorry, you good. good, good mindset to have. Yes, um, comes in handy when you're in this business because it's crazy. Um, definitely crazy. Man. So, so what's next for Ruchi Raw? What's next for me? I'm in the works of trying to get a clothing line out. I'm trying to brand myself. I'm just trying to become a legitimate rapper. I really want people to actually start taking me seriously, you know? Okay. So, I, music videos, more is clothes. There's a reason why you think they haven't taken you more seriously? <sighs> I feel like people are going to follow, you know, what is popular. So I feel like I just have to get my name out there, keep working. And it, the talent is going to show. Talent is going to show. But if you don't have that hard work and that dedication, mm -hmm. you know, it's not like you're going to go further. You know what I'm saying? So mm -hmm. I know that I have the talent. I just got to keep going and keep <laughs> Keep walking. Keep pushing. Yeah, keep pushing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. Sure. Man. So, so you're a, so you're a woman in a male-dominated industry. You know what I mean? You chasing your dreams. Is there anything you would want to say to little girls out there that'd be like, oh, okay, like how Nicki Minaj inspires you? You know what I mean? Like, is there anything you would want to say to them that would make them be like, oh, okay, if she can do it, I can do it too. If I could say anything to the little girls, I would probably wish, I wish somebody probably would have told me to recognize your worth earlier than what you, like, it's never too late, but if you recognize your worth earlier on in life, you could be able to um, probably avoid certain situations. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah so. Definitely. definitely. Just understand that you are literally a queen and a king. And this goes for anybody, not just females. Yeah. So yeah. it's just like, you know, you have to literally carry yourself. If you're not setting the bar high, you're setting it too low. Okay. So yeah, yeah, yeah. if you if you if you feel like you can make a million dollars, go ahead. I mean, don't be, you know, say in touch with reality but still be able to set those dreams and visions in long term. Always think longevity. Don't just think as of now. Because, you know, I'm 22, right. but shoot, maybe five years from now, I'll be 27 looking back at this video like, right. damn. Yeah, that's where I started. That's, right. that's where it's going down. Dang. Right. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Your, your, your mindset is super strong. I feel that. You positive. You know, you know positive vibes. You know Always got to be positive. I feel like... If you're negative, you're stressing out, it's just, it causes wrinkles. It's going, you're going to get gray hairs. You're right. not going to look as good as you can. You can tell a good, happy person. You can tell a happy person just from the glow of their skin. You know right. what I'm saying? Right, right, right. Like, so it's like that type of energy mm -hmm. most definitely yeah. translate. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm so sorry. I'm young. It's been a long day. You good. Sorry, you good. Um, <laughs> Yeah, so um, I know that. Um, so for the plans for the future, what's what's to come about? Like, do you have a plan? My plan or, is. I wouldn't. I wouldn't say the plan. I mean, but I mean. Are you I don't, thinking? 
there's certain I can't really say. I honestly just take it day by day. I know that I want to be great. Okay. But it's like certain situations I've been in, I would never even see myself being in that situation. So I don't want to just narrow off the possibilities of my life. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So it's like, I I know that I will be great. I know that I can be great. I can't really say where I would be, though. So okay. Okay. I just hope that I would be somewhere where it's like I'm taking my bloodline in a good direction. You know, I, I'm setting myself up. I'm setting my kids up. I'm setting their kids up. That's where I want to be. Cool. Do you have any kids? I have zero kids. None. Cool. cool. Best way to be. Best way to be right now. It's crazy. No, right. that's what's up. I mean, I got my godson. Yeah, I love yeah, my godson. Yeah, sure. Trust me, my godson. We ain't no kids. But <laughs> yeah. 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 No kids yeah. for me, though. You know what I mean? That's what's up. So, man, look, tell them where they can find you, though. Like, what's your socials? You know what I mean? Man, it's Richie Raw on Instagram. Ruchi Raw everywhere. I mean, uh, yeah, I got Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook. Right. I got a Facebook page that I'm trying to grow right now. I'm trying to move away from my personal Facebook page so I can get to. I don't know. I mean, I feel you on that. Moving away from your personal page. I mean, I still, but, I'm still focused on my personal yeah. page, but I still want to be yeah. able to use page. my fan page yeah. so that I could reach a bigger audience. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Cool. Well, it was a pleasure having you on. I appreciate it. um, Hopefully, we'll come back for a part two and see where you at. You know what I mean? So, yeah, it was a pleasure. For sure. I appreciate you. Y'all tune in with everything I got coming up. Most definitely. Got a lot of shit in the works. Shout out Exotic Mom Music. See you out there in Dallas. We got a lot of shit happening, so.